In 1960, five years after the European Cup was launched, South America came up with its own competition for clubs, the Copa Libertadores. For Uruguay's Peñarol, the first winners, the prospect of a contest against the European champions was the big motivation. Nos tocó jugar la final intercontinental contra el Real de Madrid. Aquí en Montevideo empatamos 0-0 y en Madrid perdimos 5 a 1. A los 20 minutos de comenzado el partido íbamos perdiendo 4 a 0. Having retained the Copa Libertadores in 1961, Peñarol faced Brazil's Santos in the 62 final. Santos would make South American club football known around the world. O europeu, pela formação europeia, ele se acha superior ao, aos latinos. E a grande disputa que tem entre os times latinos e os times europeus faz com que tenha essa rivalidade, né? porque o latino se acha mais técnico, acha um futebol mais aberto. O europeu acha que é um futebol mais organizado, um futebol mais forte. In Lisbon, in 1962, Santos thrashed the European champions Benfica 5-2 with a scintillating display of football. The following year, they retained the title against Milan. In 1966, Peñarol won another Libertadores title. Inspired by the tournament's all-time top scorer, Alberto Spencer, they met Real Madrid once again. Y Peñarol, en el año 60, eh, recién venía renovándose. Recién se venía renovando. Por eso en el 66, esa renovación dio su fruto cuando volvimos a enfrentarnos y ahí sí nos tomamos la revancha. <música> 